everybody. I'm Steve Reddick, and with me as usual is Steve Connolly as we wind our way through the culinary delights of the Unique Restaurant Group. As most of you know, the Unique Restaurant Group is a collection of uh, very interesting restaurants in and around the Hamilton Burlington area, and it's got to start somewhere. Yep. And it starts right here on Augusta Street. The Pheasant Plucker, actually there's two restaurants here, the Augusta House across the road, which we'll get to another time. But the Pheasant Plucker was the start of this unique restaurant group organization, and it is the epitome of uniqueness right here. This is an awesome Scottish bar. Yeah, it's a very old story building, um, haunted. Uh, which haunted. I didn't used to believe in that, but I've been here a few times, and a couple of things have happened <laughs> that can only be explained away by ghosts. Uh Late 1880s, it was built. <clears throat> uh, it was a home for the Argyles. There are, there were underground tunnels, which since have caved in. So there's a lot of history behind the building. And, and it was a jail. Uh, there's point, rumor it was a jail. Mm -hmm. uh, it was another pub called the Blarney Stone. A while back, oddly enough, we knew the owners of that place, and eventually this became the. I guess this is the grandfather or father of all the buildings we have. So a lot of people, you know, again, we talked about the fact there's uh, hundreds of actually over a thousand places you can eat in this area. And you want to go somewhere where it's got some atmosphere. This is one of the few places that really has some awesome atmosphere here. So let's just talk a little bit about what goes on here at the Pheasant Plucker. What's, well, uh, it's what's a, the story? To us, it's just a true Scottish pub. It has, it's one of these places that hasn't changed over the years because you don't change with something that's successful. You feel comfortable here. It's got great pub fare. The food has changed a little bit. We've changed to some of the healthier options because you can't live on steak pie and square sausage and some of the uh, Scottish delicacies aren't the greatest thing in the world for you. But the menus change, but the people are the same. Uh, and again, it's back to the basics. It's, it's good food, good beer, good times. And it's a small, intimate spot. You know, it's almost like a cheers, as we've talked about before. Yeah, and it's actually this year, oddly enough, uh, June 1st to the 3rd this year, we will celebrate the 20th anniversary of, the, of us being the owners of, of this building. So there'll be live entertainment that weekend. We've got a great bank room upstairs that's available for, mm -hmm. for rent as well. So there's just a lot to do in a, in a great old building. Lots of uh, great cold beer. Also, I just want to mention there's the breakfast, too, on the weekends. The traditional Scottish breakfast, again... Mm -hmm. You know, it might not be the healthy stuff in the world for you, but you can eat breakfast at 10 o'clock and you won't be hungry till 5 in the afternoon. So we're open for breakfast on Saturday and Sunday as well as the uh, nights. And Thursday nights we have live entertainment as well. Thursday nights, okay. Now, as usual, we like to, to sample uh, the wares here. And uh, what have we got on tap here? Something just a little bit different. So, again, you're always looking for a different experience. What can I try that I can't find anywhere else? And here at the Pheasant Plucker, what have we got on the go today? Well, we did uh, both ends of the spectrum. That is your uh, stuffed Yorkshire pudding, which is a traditional great old uh, British dish, uh, roast beef, root vegetables, oh, great. mashed potatoes, gravy. Again, that's the... The non-healthy option, and of course, <laughs> with all the changes, this is our root vegetable salad, root vegetable feta cheese. Gives you both options if you want to be the healthy person or if you want to be traditionalist, and, and beer goes with both of them. And so why not try a little bit of both? Have a little bit of a traditional, have a bit of healthy? Absolutely. I think that's a good combination, and of course, the beer is always cold yeah. here at the Pheasant Plucker. So come and try it out here on Augusta, on Augusta Street, the Pheasant Plucker. Steve, thanks again for being here. Thank you. Here.